I speak against this coronavirus that has killed and taken away so many innocent lives that it will die and be gone and won't hurt anybody else. Dear Lord, you kill this coronavirus and you heal the people that are suffering and that thank you for being a good father for us. And Jesus, I pray for the Do President Donald Trump, Jesus, and anyway, give him wisdom and guidance to lead our country in the right direction, Jesus. Father, I pray that you just heal all those who are sick and help all the doctors and nurses out there. Jesus, you are bringing any virus. Our eyes are on you, not the storm. We trust in you, Jesus. God, please just take down the coronavirus, just punch it in the face and kill it. Did you, do you know that Jesus loves you? He will never leave you and never forsake you. Okay. Lord, please help everyone that is that has the coronavirus. Whoever's, whoever is sick and and has the coronavirus, just in Jesus' mighty name, take it away. I pray that there will be no fear in any of us, and that we know that you will keep us safe. And even though this hard time, it could bring us closer together in Christians, as Christians and as a nation in our world. The Bible says in Philippians 4, 6, 7, Don't worry about anything. No matter what happens, tell God about everything. Ask and pray and give thanks to Him. Then God's peace will watch over your hearts and your minds. And I thank you for the doctors and nurses who have risked their lives caring for these people. I pray for all the volunteers, all the nurses, all the doctors, all the people in the airport that are checking people from the other states, other countries coming. You are Lord Almighty, and you deliver us from every single sickness. And I help people who protect every country and every kid and every family, Jesus. And this command is that you're always helping us. And you're never going to let us down. And I thank you. The coronavirus is dead in the name of Jesus. Amen.